talk about the translate function a little. In a previous video, we talked about scaling, which is also part of translate. But in this video, we're just going to discuss uh, moving things around the screen, which uh, may seem rather simple, but uh, or sound rather simple, but uh, can be difficult if you don't know how to do it. So the first thing we're going to do is draw a couple of entities on the screen. We'll draw a circle. This is a 14. Uh, radius of 14. We'll hit OK. We'll draw a square. And this is a 10 by 10 square. We'll hit OK. Now we can cancel out of that. And now we're going to go up to translate. And uh, we want to select the square. We're going to take the square. We're going to move it out here. And uh, in this video, we're going to concentrate on uh, using the drag function and not sketch enter. We'll cover that in, a, in another video. So uh, the first thing we want to do is select the square. Now we can do that by either uh, box selecting, drawing a box around it, or we can uh, chain select it. So you'll notice if I select uh, one line, it just selects one line. It doesn't select the whole box. That's not what we want to do. So what we want to do is chain select it. We're going to hold the shift key and uh, and click and it, it selects the whole box. It selects the line and everything that line is attached to. Next we're going to hit the uh, space key which is the same as hitting OK. Okay now you notice that it, it flashed. The gumball flashed in the center but uh, then went away. Now it, it, it didn't go away. Uh, the reason it did that is because of this offset and the end point right here. Uh, so it's here. It's uh, it's just way over here. So we're going to drag it where we want it. We're going to click again. Hit the space key. And it moves to that point. We want to move it again. We click. Move it to where we want it. Click again. Hit the space key. Now the reason it made a copy is because I have copy selected up here. Now if I just want to move it without it making a copy, I turn the copy function off, I select, I drag, I click again, I click, drag, select, click again, click, drag, space key. So now it's just moving it and it's not creating a copy. So let's talk let's talk about copy a little bit. Let's turn copy back on. Now it's set to copy uh, one part. So if we move that, I click down here, I hit the space key, and it moves it. move it again. I click, I hit the space key, it moves it. And e each time I move it, it's making a copy. So I click, I move, I click again, I hit the space key. I click, I move, I click again, I hit the space key. And you can make more than one copy if you want to at a time. Um, that may get confusing, it may not. So now we're going to take this uh, circle. We want to move this circle around. So we're going to hit reselect. We're going to select the circle. We hit the space key. And we'll take and uh, let's put that circle right up here. We click. Hit the space key. Oh, and I had copy turned on, but that's okay. Now we have two circles. So now what I want to do is I want to select the square again. So I'm going to hit reselect. I'm going to rem remember hold the shift key because we want to chain select it. Hit space. Now we have to go search for that square. There it is. Okay, so I, I clicked it and um, now I'm not holding the, the uh, left mouse button. I'm just moving the mouse around. And you see how when I drag over this circle it turns red. Well. Each entity in, in Bobcat has 
uh, snap points. To turn on the snap points, you're going to hold the shift key and left click. So I'm going to roll over that circle. I'm going to hold the shift key and I'm going to left click and it turns on those snap points. Now you see how when I get close to one of them, see how it turns red. Let's say I want to snap this circle or this square to that point on the circle. I just drag it over that point. I click and I hit the shift the uh, space key. And there it is. Let's say I want to take and move to the center of the circle. I'm going to roll over the circle again. I'm going to hold the shift key. I'm going to left click, turn on snap points. I'm going to roll over until that center dot turns red. And I'm going to click now we have a square at the center of the circle. So that's basically clicking and dragging. Remember to uh, chain select. Uh, you have to uh, hold the shift key and click. And if you want to turn on snap points, you're going to roll over the entity until it turns red. And then hold the shift key and left click. It turns on your snap points. That, that, that's basically how uh, Translate works in drag mode. And in the next video, we'll cover uh, sketch and enter mode.